I, I performed in Italy uh, recently. It was a, it was a, yeah, it was beautiful. And I took my wife and we went, it was in Tuscany. Now we check in to our hotel room. We go to the pool, start looking around the pool. See a beautiful couple come down, beautiful couple. Just on their honeymoon, you could tell they're recently married, stunning. Woman was well put together, had a nice sun hat on, big brim, nice wedge. <laughs> Ladies, get yourself a nice wedge for the pool deck. Had a nice see-through sash, beautiful, just blew in the wind. <laughs> Guy had a nice swim trunk on, right here, mid-thigh. Guys, get yourself a nice trunk for the season. <laughs> you seen some of these men that wear this uh, swimsuit down in it? What are you wearing, slacks? <laughs> they get out of the pool, half of the pool's caught in their legs. So they get into the pool, they start to swim as a couple. I've never seen anything like it. She's doing the breaststroke, just. The guy's doing the butterfly. You know how confident you have to be to pull off the butterfly? I've never seen the butterfly outside the Olympics, this guy. It's doing a recreational butterfly on his honeymoon. You know how violent that is? The entire pool looks like a jacuzzi. Kids are drowned. Then I'm looking at these kids. I don't even know what they're wearing, these kids. They're covered from head to toe. Eight-year-old kid. He's got long sleeves on. He's got a hat with flaps over his ears, SPF 30,000. What the hell? Kid looks like a mime. He's got every apparatus I known to man, breathing tube, goggles, flippers. What are you looking for? It's a pool, there's no coral. I had none of this growing up. I asked my father, Dad, I want to look underneath the water. Open up your eyes! <laughs> By the end of the vacation, I was blind. I couldn't see shit. <laughs> so they stopped swimming. Guy's out of breath. I'm looking at him, he's got long hair. The type of hair you gotta dip in the pool and then flip back. Oh God, as soon as I saw that, I tapped my wife, I go, we gotta meet this guy. This guy's sensational. <laughs> and I don't know if you've ever talked to somebody so magnificent before that you have nothing to share. I had nothing to tell this guy. This guy had multiple careers. At 16, he played in the French Open. At 32, he had a big law firm. Now he's running a big hedge fund. Then he tells us, we summer in Capri. Where do you summer? Our backyard. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. We take a week off a year. You got the summers?